Most of the scenes are stem from real life situations, but we've kind of turned them up a bit because my, my real life is not that exciting um, <coughs> or funny, hopefully. Uh, and I think my character is a little bit more uh, unaware and more American, uh, let's say, than I am. I hope. Um, so that enables us to be a little bit more, a little bit funnier, I think, in, in how we portray the scenes. But pretty, uh, you know, other than the fact he's an accountant and I was a lawyer, that was a big change that we made. Uh, other than that, it's it's very uh, autobiographical. I, well, I'd say my my wife's family um, is much more supportive, though, than. Bruce's uh, girlfriend's family who don't really like him um, from the beginning at least. I don't know how, like, he's so charming. Swedes in general are, are um, very uh, familial. I mean the first, first day, I, uh, the whole base uh, genesis of the, of the idea for the show was based on my, my first day in Sweden I came directly off the plane to my wife's summer house uh, and there was like 40 of her relatives there waiting for me with drinks in hand um, singing songs and that really set the tone for my <laughs> for my life my Swedish life and I can remember thinking during that day like this would make a really funny movie um, and now it is uh, a TV show so uh, I think in general they, they're, they're very big into kind of tradition and family and uh, drinking uh, shots and um, singing songs. That's that's the key to being a Swede. <laughs> yeah, which I've adapted to, especially the drinking part. Um, but uh, I, I think the, the good thing about the show is it's about an American living in Sweden, but we, we tried to make the themes more universal in terms of, you know, just classic fish out of water. I think everybody can identify with feeling a little bit out of the loop and um, you know the outsider having to kind of start over and reinvent yourself you know it can be a new job it could be going to a new school or anything like that um, and then the the second part of that is this is this relationship it's very much of a relationship uh, based show and that the main characters <coughs> um, love each other very much and if, if they were in isolation uh, everything would be great because they do kind of maintain their love throughout but it's these external factors that are kind of uh, putting pressure on the relationship so, so that's the, the, the whole arc of the first season is basically w is he going to stay will he will he make it because he hasn't thought of any of this when he when he when he, he when he leaves he's, a, he's a, a life in New York with lots of celebrity clients and um, just kind of impulsively decides to move to Sweden without actually thinking it through so there's this kind of great scene with uh, Lena Olin who plays uh, his mother-in-law the first, when he c comes off the plane and, and goes to their house and she's sitting there going through, the, so let me get this straight, you gave up a, a great job, <laughs> you have no friends, you don't speak the language, uh, and you, you have no job, and you just came here just to live with our daughter, and he, it's like the first time he's actually thought of that, so he's like, uh, yes, I guess, <laughs> that accurately describes it. She was not. That, that, that's the, been the amazing thing for me about this process. I mean, I was not in the industry at all for ever. <laughs> I was in a first grade play, which is pretty, pretty convincing. Um, but most of my friends and family, when I told them what I was doing, they were like, oh, yeah, yeah, you know, you should have been doing that years ago. I was like, why didn't you guys say something? <laughs> why did you never say anything to me? And well, we thought you didn't want to do it. I, go, I, I didn't know you guys thought I could. So that's been her uh, reaction, really, I think. Um, not very surprised, uh, which is nice, I guess, but also a little bit disappointing that she didn't give me a role in one of her shows for the past 12 years if she thought I could do it. <laughs>